Oh, dude, this is sweet. Alright, who's ready to fly? Yeah. Alright, welcome to Miss Star Street Film Fighters Elite. I've got Jake Jepson here. And uh, he is finally done with his um, MF35 Lightning. Yeah. This is a prototype, right? Yep. And uh, talk about the build, man. Talk about the design. How did it all piece out? What do we still have to do to make this thing ready for our viewers? Alright, so I kind of just start off uh, free designing it, but then. Uh, it wasn't really looking good, so I thought we should base it off of the uh, F-18 Eagle. The Eagle? Which F-18? Which was kind of close to it if you looked at pictures online. So we started with the design and we changed it up a bunch. Uh, you can just see a lot of the angles and stuff are different. And voila. Voila, that's what you have. Now, you, you've come a long way to have something like this. I mean, this is hands down one of the coolest looking planes, I think we have to date. And we we made some changes. What are some of the changes that we made to the prototype? So we, we fixed, you fixed the front, right? Yeah, we had like a bunch of different like, we're trying to get, because on the pictures we had like a little slope and slope here and we were just trying to figure that all out. And so the prototype didn't have it, but this one uh, has it more. Yeah. Cool. And then what do we do differently for the engine? Do we do anything, do we do anything back here differently? Yeah, we just changed up the design because yeah, I, I, I drew like a really crappy engine, so we changed it up and it looks a lot nicer now. Yeah, well that's okay. I mean, it was, it's yeah. still the, the basic shape, the basic shape that we have um, for the plane is, is is really really cool. Now this is this is really cool because uh, you have four control surfaces. Yeah. So we weren't able to do one complete elevator, right? Yeah. No. And so we we're hoping that this is going to be better for beginners because you only have the two control surfaces to work with. You don't have to do any cutting, yeah, but right? Because this one we had to do some cutting in the back to make those yeah. flaps. Now we don't have to do that, right? Yeah. And then, <clears throat> what else did we think of? We were thinking that you can install the servos just when you are building it because when you start flying it, you can start with the uh, beginner, beginner, uh, uh, ailerons. ailerons, and then you can go to the advanced ailerons, and the servos are already being. Yeah. So. Cool. I think that's a cool idea, dude. Um, in terms of the the uh, the timeline here, we are going to try to maiden this today, right? Yeah. yeah. And then if it's all successful, we're going to go to your build video. Yeah. And so we're hoping by Christmas time. Yeah, probably around sometime around there. And you're releasing your plans to, to the public? Yeah. Awesome. So, uh, Jepson, um, you, or Jake, you, you've come a long way. You created yeah. the Jepson, right? Yeah. And now the Jepson was uh, probably your, your second most, uh, probably your most, second most popular download, believe it or not, uh, on our website. Cool. Um, and then, what did you do before that? Well, the first plane I built was just one of the original designs we had. Uh, before I even got Mesa and uh, Mr. Marshall just suggested building one of those. So we built it, but since it was my first time building, I built it really, really bad. <laughs> and uh, I just remember we threw it up in the air and the control surfaces were all messed up and it just flew to the tree. <laughs> nice. But from the tree to here. I yeah, guess. That's, uh, that's really impressive. So you're, you, Jake's only a freshman now. And I don't know if you plan on staying with the program only until yeah, you graduate. Yeah. Um, but it'll be really interesting to see you know, what what Jake is going to be capable of. Jake is an amazing designer. Um, he's got CAD skills down like any other, and he, he can draw whatever he wants now. Um, and you know, thus coming up with something like this. The next thing we got to get you to do is, is to fly, right? Yeah, yeah. Jake Jake yeah. loves to be on the computer and design stuff, and then the flying kind of sh shies away yeah. from. Him. We got to get you to fly because. Yeah. I think you'll be, you know have a better understanding of the design piece when you know if you know how it flies and how it works. Yeah. You'll know exactly how big of the surfaces you need to make for planes and all that. So, um, well, do you want to go out and back and fly this thing? Yeah. All right, let's do it.
drive runs, it's, it's really hard to even roll it. Jake, this is awesome. Oh, dude, this is sweet. This is perfect. No freaking way. Oh, that's beautiful. All right, dude, you ready? I'll give it to you. Uh, you got about half throttle on there? Come around one more time here. Oh, this is too cool. Okay, let's go. Keep, it, keep that nose up. Turn right. There you go. Dude. Perfect. The Bermuda Trial. Keep turning right. There you go. Oh, sick. What do you think, man? You're good. Keep turning right. No way, Jake. Oh, that's too cool. Fly anything by us. Right, go right. Go right. There you go. Keep going towards us. Left, left. Give it a little more throttle. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Keep going. Turn that right. Turn that right. Keep going 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 right. You're getting too far away, it's gonna be hard for you to tell. It's got good vertical for the 212 on it. Oh, too cool. Prototype, a success. Yeah. Yes. Um, well, tell us about it, man. You flew most of the time by yourself. Yeah, I mean, it's amazingly smooth. I mean, uh, I think I remember flying the Jepson and the Apprentice, mm -hmm. and the Jepson was way worse than this. I mean, this is so smooth. And then the Apprentice is almost exactly the same. I mean, it's just, some people say it's on rails. I kind of think it's like a, a cloud almost. It's just smooth. It's not like jittering up and down it's just nice and smooth perfect man cool and you we're all we're doing is running those um elvron setups in the back right yeah so we'll definitely do that on yours yeah. but we'll insert those servos so that when you get good at it and you want to start getting some yeah. crazy rolls yeah. and stuff yeah. um and we maybe when we make the build video too we'll we'll have both hooked up so you can fly yeah. and then we'll put a new battery in put the new ones or the hook up the ailerons and see yeah how crazy it would be. Dude, good job. Um, well, look for this in the future. And uh, thanks for watching.